what's up everyone welcome to another video on my youtube channel so in this video i will be showing you how to remove any object a person or anything from your videos by using wondershare filmora so this is a little bit complicated so make sure to watch this video till the end and you will be able to do the same also this is not going to work on every single video but till the end of this video you will have an idea on which type of video this is going to work and it can be tough on some videos and easy on others so make sure to at least try once and if you face any problem you can comment down below if i will be able so then i will help you and now we won't waste any of the time let's get started so here we are and here is the video i am going to use in this tutorial actually i couldn't find any other video but one thing you have to make sure the subject should not be moving a lot if it's moving a lot or the camera is shaking the camera is not stationary at one place then it will be a little more complicated for you to create but in this video you can see the subject is not moving at all just a little it's moving in the starting and after that it's stationary that's why i search for some another video because it's actually a little more easy to edit this picture but no matter i will show you step by step and i will tell you everything to remove anything from your video so now what we have to do first bring this video down here on the timeline number one and again to the timeline number second now you may have got an idea we are going to create a mask and we will use other parts of the videos like this mountain this side or any other side you can choose we are going to display it in the place of this person so for that you may know that we don't have a type of preset of mask in filmora so we are going to create our custom mask to do that we have to use an editor not an expensive software we are going to use an online editor but before that you have to take a snapshot so that you get an idea of how and where you want your mask to be so i am clicking on this camera icon and here is our snapshot now you have to open your browser and here you have to search for pixlr here is it pixlr.com click on this and now click on advanced pixlr e it's totally free to use and now we have to open our image I have plenty of screenshot I took them before and now you have to hold alt and zoom out so now what we have to do is we have to draw on our subject with black but before that we have to go here to the plus icon and we will add an empty layer now select this empty layer and go to this brush icon click on the brush and select a hard round they are actually all same but with different sizes you can adjust the size from here also i will take the softness to 0% also the step to 0% opacity should be 100 and click on this hard tip and now just simply draw it here just like this and it's done now i will untick and hide our background so this is how our mask looks like we are going to invert it later so now you have to press ctrl plus s on your keyboard to save this and make sure to save it as a png file click on download and now let's open our filmora again so now we have to apply image mask on this second layer go to effects utility section you will find the image mask bring it down here apply it on the second timeline now double click on this go down on the video effect section you will find this image mask they are the presets now we are going to load our own preset by clicking on this you just have to select your image that we just saved and get down at the last here we have our mask now click on invert mask and hide this layer 
so now as you can see how it looks like and we are going to unhide it click ok now we will lock our layer number two and select our second layer and now you have to select other parts of the scene we are going to fix this we will increase the feather later so you have to make it it shouldn't look fake you can increase the size also that will help you to make it better I will increase the size a little more and this is almost perfect let me just fix this so now I have set it to the right place now we are going to increase the feather and then we are done double click on this and here is our image mask section go down and increase the feather and now you can see it's done don't take it to 100 if you will the person is also going to come if it's on the side so i will take it to somewhere here and it looks totally perfect hit ok and now we are done our video is completed so let me show you it was like this and now it's like this so i hope you like this tutorial so don't forget to like this video subscribe to the channel also follow me on instagram link is in the description thanks for watching